Hey, we're now at the Patriot of African Descent Memorial that was placed here about three years ago. There was 700 African Americans that was part of the Continental Army here. And I said, General Varner, when they came, they were either freed slaves, free men, or they were slaves who were getting their freedom if they fought in the American Revolution. So this monument is dedicated to the African Americans that were here. And we see there was probably somewhere between three to 5,000 African Americans who fought for the Continental Army throughout the revolution. And as an historian, many people ask me, particularly where we are in American history, are we rewriting a history? And I say, no, we're revealing more of our history. And as time goes on, because we believe that history is a study of human behavior, we're now being able to teach much more of our story, whether it's the women of the revolution, African-Americans in the revolution, immigrants in the revolution, and all throughout our, 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 our history. So we're beginning to see more of our history, and we're beginning to pay more, much more attention to what we historians call bottom-up of American history, and incorporating not just the founding fathers and these generals that we know, but everybody that was involved, particularly here at Valley Forge, with the American Revolution. We know the first patriot killed was Christmas Attucks at the, uh, up in Boston. And we see even here, Isaac and Hannah Till, they play tremendous roles in helping supply and feed the, the troops here. So when we look at our history, we have to remember that it's all of our history and we just can't pick out certain parts of our history, whether it's the good parts or the, our warts in our history, we have to show it reveal it and teach it. So we're happy that a couple of years ago, this monument was dedicated to the African Americans that were here and the role that they played in the American Revolution. And then also the Native Americans that were here. We had about 500 Oneida Indians that were here during the winter encampment and also fought in, in, in Washington's Continental Army. So the, the monument was dedicated to all the patriots of the American Revolution that were African-American descent. And we're very glad and we're very happy that now we're beginning to be able to look at that part of our history and incorporate that into our history and particularly the story of our American Revolution.